Hey everyone, welcome to 360 Nails TV, the official YouTube channel of 360nails.com. If you're new here, be sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell for two new videos every week. I generally upload at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so make sure your notifications are on so you know when I upload new videos. Okay, so today's video, I'm going to be continuing my top six series with my top six China Glaze polishes. Believe it or not, this was super hard to choose. I think China Glaze is the brand I have the most polishes from, and a lot of them are my favorites, so this was hard to narrow down. But I did it, so let's take a look. Okay, so the first one I'll be showing you is one out of six, and then I do have a bonus polish just because I could not narrow it down. I got it down to seven, and I wasn't sure which one to eliminate, so I'm including a bonus polish in this video. So the first one I'll be showing you, actually the first three I'll be showing you are from their um, Spring Fling collection from last year. That was the first several China Glazes that I bought. So this first one is called Too Much of a Good Fling, and this is pulling a little more blue on camera. This is actually a really gorgeous mint polish, which you can kind of see where it's separated here at the top, but I will have a swatch of this and more accurately shows the color. And this is a gorgeous kind of, I would say, seafoam green. That's more what I like to describe this polish as versus mint because I think that's more what it is. And this is a really good cream. It's two coats. It has a great formula, and I just think it's really pretty. I like using this in the spring and in the summer for especially mermaid manicures and beach manicures. I think it's really pretty. And yeah, this is one of my first favorite china glazes. So that is is too much of a good flame by China Glaze. This next one is the silver I always go for when I'm doing nail art, and it is super pretty. This is It's About Time, and this one, I think I showed this recently in another video, but I'm not sure, so you may have seen this quite recently, and this is so beautiful. It is kind of, it's a very chromey silver. It's not too, I guess, it doesn't have a lot of particles in it, but you can kind of see it throughout the polish, but what I really like about this is it just has kind of a green vibe, like a blue to green kind of aura, I guess, and you can kind of see if you look close, not really in this lighting, but if you look super close at the bottle, you can see it does have slight flecks of blue and green shimmer in it, so I think that's really nice. I love pairing this with cooler tone polishes because I think it just goes really well with it, and yeah, this is good in probably two coats, I'd say, two to three coats, depending on your nail length, and I think it's really gorgeous, so that is, it's a boat time by Giant Blaze. I miscounted just looking at my lineup again. This is actually four polishes from last year's spring collection. This next one is so gorgeous. This is called Kiss My Sherbet Lips, and this is a beautiful kind of, this, I wouldn't even call this a medium pink. I would almost call this a light berry pink, I think, because it is so pretty. It has, yeah, I guess it's a medium pink with berry undertones. We'll go with that. It has kind of this very, very, very slight yellow gold shimmer in it. You can't really see the shimmer on the nails, but it just does add a nice touch to this polish. I think I paired this with a holographic glitter one time and it came out really nice as a manicure, but I did want to compare this for you guys with Strawberry Fields, another kind of, I think this is a more famous tiny glaze polish. I see it in Sally Beauty a lot, and as you can see, they're kind of similar, but this one definitely has more red undertones. This one has more berry undertones, and this one has a stronger pink shimmer, but these are a little bit similar. Both really beautiful. This one has a bit of a different formula. I thought this might take three coats, but it actually surprised me by almost being a one coater. So I like both of these, but I put this one in the video because I just really like the color. So that is Kiss My Sherbet Lips by China Glaze from last year's collection. We have Suns Out, Buns Out. I was so happy when I finally found this polish. i had been looking for it forever and I only needed this one and a few others to complete that collection and I finally found it because if you check your local Sally Beauty you'll see that they've added some China Glaze polishes from collections but they're now in their core section where all the regular polishes are and I'm really glad they did because this is a beautiful kind of peachy cantaloupe gold orangey topper. <laughs> That's how I'll describe it for you. It's really beautiful and I do enjoy pairing this with another polish from that same collection. This is I Just Cantaloupe and these look absolutely gorgeous together. I highly recommend if you have these two that you pair them together. And that was the entire reason I wanted this polish because it goes really well with this one. But this looks really cool over a variety of polishes. That is Suns Out, Buns Out by China Glaze. 
Moving on, another one of my favorite China glazes, and this one is actually from last year's uh, holiday or Christmas collection. This is called Santa's Side Chick. You can see the bottle, the bottle is a little messy, but this is a beautiful kind of, I guess, yeah, Christmas red, and it is so gorgeous. It has a lot of shimmer in it and it dries matte. This is actually one of the China Glaze mattes that I do really like the formula on. It doesn't dry super fast. I use this so much over Christmas and the holiday season and I really enjoy how this looks. It just, it's so pretty. It's hard to describe but I will put a picture in soon and you can see just how beautiful this is because the matte formula doesn't take away from it at all. It just makes it look even more gorgeous. I actually prefer this with a matte formula even though usually with a matte polish I will put a glossy topper over it. I really really like how this one looks. It's the perfect polish for Christmas and holidays and actually year-round if you wanted a little bit more I guess sparkle to your red nail. This is so beautiful. So that is Santa's Side Chick by China Glaze. The last one and the bonus <laughs> that I have to show you are from this year's Chic Physique collection and I do have a swatch and review for that collection so I will link that in the cards over here. And this first one I have to show you is called At Your Athleisure and I couldn't believe that I actually put these in the same video but <laughs> this, is, uh, this is too much of a good fling and this is At Your Athleisure. In person they look different but on camera they look pretty similar but this one is definitely more blue and this one is definitely more seafoam green mint so that's why I did include them both because they are my favorite china glazes so this one has an absolutely gorgeous formula it's pretty thick and it's almost kind of runny but thick which is kind of strange but it actually works really well and this is good in probably one to two coats I would say if you have really short nails you might be able to do this in one coat but I do two coats and it's so gorgeous I really really love using this in nail art I've used it a lot lately in nail art and yes that's really gorgeous this is at your athleisure by China Glaze Finally for our bonus because I just noticed it on my shelf and I could not put it in this video because it's so beautiful. This is Work It Honey by Chine Blaze again and it is so pretty. It has this absolutely gorgeous um, formula, just gorgeous formula. This is probably the best yellow that I have in my nail polish collection. It is good in, well the first time I used it it was three coats but then I think it came to be about a two coater eventually. You can see I've used quite a bit of this polish and it is super, super pretty. It's good. I actually like this kind of yellow on my skin tone. This kind and I think, let me show you another one. These two are pretty similar in color. This one's a little bit lighter, but these types of yellows I think look good on my skin tone. So if you have sort of a paler skin tone, then I think this will look really good on you. And that polish I just showed you, by the way, was Simple Colors Yellow Yellow. Anyway, this polish is absolutely gorgeous. It is perfect for spring and summer. I'll probably use it a lot during the summer, and I can't wait to do some maybe like pineapple ice cream nail art with this. I think that'd be really cute. This reminds me of the color of a Dole Whip, the ice cream that you can get at Disney World or Disneyland, and this is super pretty. So that is Work It Honey by China Glaze, my bonus polish. So that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what your favorite China Glaze polish is and what your favorite was from this video. And yeah, I think that's it for today. If you want to see more videos like this, definitely hit that subscribe button. And I will see you in my next video. Have a polished rest of your day. Bye.